Some people know science is fun. Others need to be convinced. Artist and educator Larry Moss combines art, science, and fun in a unique stage show. How to catch a mouse. So I think it's time to go ahead and build the coolest mousetrap in the entire world. Who's with me? Listen, when you can't find a machine that works the way you want, you can make your own. You can use an artistic medium to create something. I'm going to push down on this end of my lever. Alex here does all my work for me. So even though I pushed down, she changed the direction of the force that I applied, so the swan went up. So imagine if we had two levers and joined them, a giant pair of scissors. That's just two levers with a fulcrum right in the middle holding them together. Is the wheel turns, the axle stays still, but the wheel turns. Now, I pull on the rope and the pulley turns. I pull down in the same direction gravity is pulling me. The bike goes up, I let go and gravity pulls it down. An inclined plane is a ramp, a slope. Something that makes it possible to move from one level to another more slowly than jumping up and down. The air molecules climbing up the sides are forcing it to spin. So we've now talked about levers, wheels, pulleys, inclined planes, and screws. All of the simple machines that I need to build the coolest mousetrap in the world and all of the simple machines that you guys would need to build a lot of the things that, that you might end up wanting to build someday. And it's all about using your imaginations. So if I turn the screw, the screw will push down on the lever, lifting up that end of the incline plane, causing the ball to roll down, fall at the end, then the scissors, scissors, goes rope, gets cut, cake falls on top of the mouse, and reach underneath, pick up the mouse and carry it outside.